This will be our final week of senior night tributes. We know we will never, ever get to everyone, but each story we get to is every story, really. Back in mid-March, when Bucknell's baseball team knew the season was over, they held their own senior day with one another. They said so long to nine seniors, Tyler, Josh, Alex, John Paul, Matt, Evan, Charlie, and Nate. So many of these stories have been about teams who might have been on the brink of a title. Bucknell's baseball team was not. But that doesn't diminish what these guys mean to each other and what they meant to Bucknell. You don't have to have been the best team to be worthy of our regard. So one last time, fellas, let's break it down. Wasting right. <coughs> on three, fam. You on six. One, two, three, four, five, five six. Yeah. Seven. The Kansas Jayhawks weren't the only basketball team in Lawrence who had title aspirations. Bishop Seabury ended the year on a school record 15 game winning streak. Their head coach Jonathan Rainey said quote this group loved to be with each other. We were a team in every sense of the word. They were 22 and 2. They were looking to win their first ever state title. How many of these stories have we heard among their four seniors starting point guard Kobe Green who returned from open heart surgery in late January of 2019 to play and he helped lead this Seahawks team. At the core of really every one of these stories is some version of the quote from J.J. Bamberger about his Saginaw Heritage hockey team. All they want to do is play. Back-to-back -back state finalists in Michigan D1 hockey, they were in their third consecutive Final Four when the Michigan High School Athletic Association, ahead of many other states, postponed athletic events. At the time, Bamberger said, quote, they haven't said cancel. Until they say cancel, we have to have a little hope, close quote. Friday and what had to feel more like a formality than anything else they said cancel Sunday Saginaw's Twitter feed listed the accomplishments of Matt Parker Brady Connor Brad Will Jordan and Jacob their seniors and I noticed on top of all the goals and all the points and all the on ice accomplishments everyone was all conference academic well done boys Army and Navy have been featured here. Let's introduce you to an executive officer in Cadet Squadron 19 in the Air Force Academy. It's Zach Nelson, who also happens to be the WAC Swimmer of the Year. At the WAC Championships in Houston, he won three individual events. It was part of two winning relay teams. It was the first Falcon to qualify for the NCAA since 2016. Let's stay in the pool and let's close in Mill Valley, California with the girls of Tamil Pius, many of whom were part of the NorCal D2 winning water polo team who were hoping to add some swimming hardware to the trophy case. Danica, Elena, Laura, Alex, who will swim at San Diego State University, Shane, Maddie, who will swim at Santa Cruz, UC Santa Cruz, that is, a couple of Emily's, that's Peters and Shower, Lauren, Sam, who will play water polo at Stanford, and Phoenix. Friday in California, the CIF canceled spring sports. So their last memory will have to be the red-tailed Hawks giving it to their rivals from Redwood, which, according to an alum I know out there, ain't all bad. Four more nights of senior night are on the way. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.